What's up everybody? Tiffany Outdoors here. Guess what guys? They have finally arrived. There's the hawk. Before there was a Tiffany Outdoors, there was Tiffany the farmer. Farm you turn when possible. No, we're not. isopods are here I have the box right here just pick them up off the porch let's go and open them up I hope they're all alive oh my goodness I hope they're all alive so I'm gonna get the bin get them opened up get them in their new home as quickly as possible let's do this zombie apocalypse knife All right, let's get these babies open. And I'll show y'all what I did with the lid over here. Let's see. Seat here. Oh, yes, I see movement, y'all. Make sure that there's nothing else in here. Just nothing. All right. Oh, look, there's one right on top. There's one right there. This is what I got. 30 powder orange isopods. All right, so, ooh, need my knife again. Just tape all around this. Hopefully there's no casualties. All right, let me cut this open very carefully because this knife is sharp. Now I already got my, my springtails in here. go. I may have put a little too much springtail food in there. It's a little a little too moldy. Moldier than I would like. But here we go. Let's open these babies up. Let me zoom you guys in. And I'm just going to dump the entire pack and container in there along with all the contents inside. I do like that they did package them up really well so that there's no escapes or that the lid didn't come off in shipping. It's quite a few and they're really, really orange. And there they go. Part of me kind of wished that I had taken them out one by one and counted them. Make sure they're sturdy. They don't look like 30. They dissipated pretty quickly. 
but honestly, I let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, is that a thirteen? Got some small juveniles in there too, which is good. I kind of like that. Looks like uh, so far all I see is one dead one. And with shipping, you know, it's it's bound to happen. It's bound to happen. But they seem to be crawling all over the place and getting acclimated here. And I, I couldn't be more excited. Oh, there's a little teeny tiny one. A little itty bitty baby right there. Sweet, very happy. And they shipped it, shipped them in with some moss. They had some moss in there, some moistened, look like a moistened paper towel and um, a little bit of substrate. So they were packaged very pretty well. So very good. And there's a bunch of springtails. I lifted up. I lifted up. Uh, this right here and there's a bunch of springtails right underneath that so that makes me happy to see all the springtails in there so very very happy all right guys let me show you what I did with the lid because I wasn't so sure about the ventilation I went ahead and put some holes in it on this one end and that's gonna match up with the screen end that I did there so that they'll have a a dry side I'm gonna make this the drier side and this side the wetter side that way they can self-regulate however they need to whatever moisture they need so that'll be that and I'm probably not gonna feed them for a few days I'm gonna let them get acclimated and then by in about three days I'll go ahead and add some food in there but until then I'm gonna go ahead and put them on their shelf and tonight I'm going to make a a sticker with my with my my Cricut and label this bin and until then I want to put this on there just to identify them until I get my label made All right time to put these guys up Alright y'all, this is just the beginning. I am very, very excited to get these guys in today, so I'm very happy. I've got uh, probably a few more things that are coming, and it's just the beginning. I cannot wait. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys when something else awesome happens. We'll open the spin in a few days and check on them and go ahead and feed them. And I will see you guys then. I'll talk to you later. Bye.